All right, tonight a live look over Uptown from our exclusive Arlington camera as a major push in the Queen City gets going for new bike lanes and walking trails. We've seen them pop up just about everywhere from Noda and South End, but now community leaders living in one area say it's time for city and county leaders to start looking east to west instead of just north to south. Queen City News reporter Maureen Wirtz joins us live right now off of Central Avenue in East Charlotte. Maureen, you spoke with folks in the community who say unless you're driving there just isn't enough options right now to get around in East Charlotte. Tell us about this. Well, Alicia, just take a listen right now. I'm right off of Central Avenue and you can hear all of the cars driving by. It's a really busy street and yeah, there's a bike lane right here, but community advocates say it's too close to the road and there just needs to be more options out here. It's hard not to drool when seeing all the cakes and the pastries at Manolo's Latin Bakery. If you want to visit the world, you just come to Central Avenue. You don't have to go to New York. But what makes this all so special is the connection owner, Manolo Bentacor, makes with everyone who comes in. I have seen people that they say, oh, I've been in Charlotte for 25 years, and this is my first time in Central Avenue. His bakery has been off of Central Avenue for the last 25 years. From pastries, from Mexico to Argentina. He says he's made this a destination that many have to drive to. And it's crazy how people drive, man. You know, people, you don't pay attention to in the light. People just shoot their cars to you. I actually have been working on connectivity for East West for 10 years. <laughs> Maureen Galeski is with Charlotte East and says it's time that East Charlotte was connected to the rest of the city through bike lanes and sidewalks. It's you've got to have either um, a, a reasonable walk or a bike ride or some safe, efficient way to connect. It all has to connect. They're putting out a survey for folks living in East Charlotte, asking them where they like to be connected to and why they don't ride or walk. This is the magic of East Charlotte. You always feel that you are welcome in this city and you are welcome in this side of town. Manolo says all are welcome because good food. My favorite is like this, this is like a pound cake. Has a way of bringing everyone together. So it's all about connection and that survey should be live soon according to officials with East Charlotte. Now they say they're planning on focusing on zip codes and places in the area so they can get the most input and then push for the most change. Live in East Charlotte, Maureen Wirtz, Queen City News. All right, Maureen, thank you so much.